Good morning, YouTubers. This is Marilyn again. I wanted to show you my orchid. I'm very proud of this orchid. It has bloomed so beautifully. Oh my God, it's amazing. Um, I did buy this orchid last year at the Fort Lauderdale Orchid Show. And it had two flowers when I bought it. And it will bloom for me again with two beautiful flowers. It's like a neon yellow greenish color with the pink and yellow lip um, if you can see here the petals at the edge has like a ring like a pinky ring around it is fragrant very nice fragrant you see the size is so let me see here you can see better it's very large flower it's amazing how beautiful it is um, let me show you the tag so if anybody's interested okay, they can look it up let me see if I can get closer there we go oh, you see I bought it last year I like I have been lately using this method of uh, putting the year that I buy the orchid so that way it helps me to keep track of how old my orchids are or for at least how long I have had them. Because I have many for so many years and I don't even remember. I don't have the tags, don't have the names, nothing. It's like, you know, no information at all. So this one got infested with the black rot. So it was a very scary moment for me because I never had that before. So I have to fight it. And I didn't even know that it was called black rot. So I learned that from another YouTuber watching videos. So, but I was able to save it and as you can see, she came out pretty nice. Um, this is her permanent home. I like to put my orchids in this beautiful planter so they become part of, you know, decoration too. Uh, they are not that expensive. I bought it for $6.99 and rose. That would be pretty much the same size of a regular, you know, planter. So I decided to do it that way. We will see when the plant grows out of it. What would I do? I don't know. When the time is arrived, I will figure it out. As you can see, I have a new one coming out. I put this little wire here, trying to keep it straight. So if it blooms, I can enjoy the flowers because you know, having this huge plant in the kitchen takes a lot of space. Um, I prefer to have, you know, the tubers straight up to keep it you know, don't heat in the plants all the time with my hands while I'm in the kitchen. I have another flower here, it hasn't opened, but this one you see is heating the cabinet here, so it makes a little bit. I mean, I feel like I'm hurting the plant every time that I hit the plant by accident. But um, as you can see, I put it deep down so that way, when the roots grow out of here the plant can last longer in this plant so I don't have to whip it. I don't really like to whip at orchids and um, you see we have like those uh, rocks and they sell at the orchid supply places I'm experimenting with this I just bought a new one and I put it in this too see how that one does this one did very well no issues with her and um, this one is a uh, relative to the twinkle I bought it this year at the Orchid Show in Tamiami. Uh, by mistake, I thought it was Twinkle, but it's not. Um, it's fragrant too. I will say that I like better the baby cherry because the fragrance is stronger. Um, this one, I don't really, you know, I bought it, I'm gonna take care of it but so far I'm not so much in love with it it's just another orchid in my you know in my garden but I'm not really passionate maybe when the time you know passes and it grows larger and bigger maybe I will fall in love desperate crazy like everybody else in YouTube and they you know have their twinkles and they speak wonders of it so far I'm okay with it but not too excited over here I have my nodosa. 
this one I did buy this orchid at the local Lowe's store. It came in a plastic bag with a tag. I bought it for $11.99 or $12.99. I don't remember, but it's around that price. Uh, it bloomed a year after and it had been great to me because it's been growing and blooming constantly after one year. Um, it had been free of disease, uh, nothing, no issues at all with this orchid. It had been wonderful. This one here, I bought it at the local Home Depot for $5. It was on sale. It was in bad condition. So I bought, they had five for $5 each. I only bought two because they had no flowers and I didn't know what kind of orchid, what color, nothing. So I only bought two. And I hope and pray that the other one is a different color, so I have two different kind of orchids for it. Unbeatable price. You cannot beat that price. Um, well, that's basically pretty much. As you all know, I like to bring my orchids to my kitchen. And I have kids, so I spend a lot of time in the kitchen. So this is the way for me to enjoy my orchids. Um, until next uh, video, thank you so much for watching, hit like if you like, uh, if you have any suggestions, any comments, um, I will appreciate it, thank you so much.